Hey guys, welcome to the Dennis McCoy YouTube channel. As you guys know, I'm a photographer. And I don't know why this is, but I think this goes for everybody. Um, and I'm hoping that it will work better this time because I've had my video webcam capture software that I was on my computer. Because this is the way I do it, because it's faster to do it this way than it is to do a video and all my video devices um, don't either have an SD card big enough like my phone or um, my batteries are bad so I have to get new gear but every time I go to get a new piece of gear it's either too expensive or I go to rent that piece of gear and like the 7200 that I'm going to rent um, coming up for the next 30 days or so. And, um, the company I'm going to rent it from does it for $54 a week or so. For seven days. And I was going to rent it for five days earlier so that I can get it in time because it says to allow five day shipping and whatnot to your house. Well, so think about like a month earlier, roughly. But I don't think you get you don't get charged to to so to your house. But anyway, um, because I have tracker and everything. Um, I rented this. I'm going to run the seventy two hundred for a special occasion I'm doing right now. I'm not gonna release any information in case this video does reach my Facebook page friends. Um, so, um, uh, anyway, um, I don't think it will, but anyway, no one really, other than my aunt and my cousin, I don't think anyone else, I don't even think my aunt or my cousin really pay attention to my YouTube channel, but, um, I don't want this getting back to certain people. So I might even release it later. Anyway, um, I want to run a 7200, kind of for my portfolio work. I'm kind of wanting to do portfolio work while I'm down there, and I want the versatility of the 7200. And they're only 896 dollars for the camera on it. I like the I, I have well, I like the thought of the camera for 950. Six or eight hundred six dollars. So compared to eleven hundred, so on on sale. I'm sorry, I had to spill my gum up, but I was getting it and we threw up on camera. Anyway, so yeah, I am going to rent the seventy to two hundred f two point eight night core. But I'm really going to get the 7200 Tamron because Tamrons are cheaper and, it light, and it's 3 to 4 pounds lighter and from what I've heard so far. And I've heard nothing but good results. I've heard one person talk about bad results. But I think he doesn't realize that you have to give camera manufacturers, computer manufacturers, um, because they have a plus one, a plus two, a plus three, a negative two, negative one, negative three, just for an example of acceptable stuff. So you have zero, plus one, plus two, plus three, negative one, negative two, negative three for companies. Because if they were to take everything and put ne positive zero on it, let's say, they would never get any gear out there, so there has to be some sort of level of in, um, acceptance, I guess you could say, for manufacturing. So, um, so that's that, and I'm looking very excited for it. I'm even gonna bring my uh, Color Monkey Smile uh, calibrator with me. I'm literally bringing everything I have: my 35. My 18 to 55, which I want to replace with a Sigma 18 to 35, 
um, F18, because the one I have on the 35 is F2. So, and I shoot that for rings and for, I was, like, I don't really do weddings right now, but I want to do weddings. So I'm just taking photographs at my brother's wedding to you or a wedding to um be able to use it as you know my portfolio uh, i'm not gonna step over the guy's feet i'm just gonna be honest with them. hey i'm creating a photo book if you want to give me some of your images i'm doing the photo book i'm doing the uh layout of the photo book i have a plan i'm gonna use add our own pics they're a hundred bucks, and I am going to get them, and whatever they pay for, for the photographer, and I will make sure that we get on voice chat, and I check the quality of his work. Um, if there is a photographer, but 90% of people do not hire a wedding photographer, and even more for the type of wedding that my brother's having, a low-income wedding, which I think is a very well- bad, I don't want to say very well, bad disservice, because that doesn't sound right, but it's a very, because that's kind of dicking my words, but th that's a very well thing to think about, is to cut that out, but I feel like people misjudge what they're actually doing, because you're always missing a person in a photograph, and I feel like that's another reason why, because I remember back when I was five, six years old, me, my mommy, and my dad um, were were all of our photographs. Even when my dad passed away, all of our photographs were him, him and me, or her and me. We only have one photograph that was taken at a um, one of those five dollar um, strip. Like, I don't want to call it strip photos, but, you know, like one of those creative photo booth things that used to be in the mall years ago that you don't see much anymore. I've only seen, in the last year or so, I've only seen one. <laughs> in the last couple of years, I've only seen one correction. So, that's a thing. And if you guys wanted to know, somebody did get me a fidget spinner. So I'd be, I'm not good at it like most people can right now. But I'm not good at it like I'm. Somebody gave it to me because they have, they bought extra. So they gave me one because I wanted one. Um, so that's a thing. And then. Yeah, so I've been doing that a lot, and everything's good, so I'm excited to go. We're actually renting a car. It was actually cheaper to rent a car and pay the fuel than it was to take Greyhound, which is 25 hours, which would get no sleep then, because it would be the day before the wedding if we did that. Um, and it's only 16 and a half hours to drive down there. And I was kind of wanted to stop anyway at different locations anyway. So it kind of worked out in that favor. So I'll see you guys next time. Hope you're having a good day. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.